My name is Kanchan Vaikar and I'm a solutions architect from AWS Marketplace for machine learning team. A machine learning model is a mathematical model that generates predictions by finding patterns in your data. Machine learning models in AWS Marketplace are pre-trained and they can be used to solve your domain-specific use cases. You can build machine learning powered solutions easily with minimal effort by leveraging pre-trained ML models. The AWS Marketplace contains hundreds of domain-specific as well as domain-independent ML models that you can try, buy, and directly deploy using Amazon SageMaker in a secure network-isolated manner. Once deployed, you can perform inference on models via REST API call. And today, I will show you how to explore AWS Marketplace and how to try an ML model in minutes without even subscribing to it. First, you open AWS Marketplace. Then you choose Amazon SageMaker as the delivery method. Now, let's say that I'm looking for machine learning models that can identify specialized machinery such as forklifts and even potentially return the make model and year of the car in the picture. And here I see a general purpose YOLO v3 object detector model trained on COCO dataset that can detect up to 80 different categories. Well, I'm sure car is one of the categories too. And I'll show you how easy it is to try it out with a couple of pictures. To enable you to get a demo of an ML model without deploying it manually, AWS Marketplace recently enabled product demo functionality accessible from the product detail page, such as this. This functionality lets you perform an inference on the model in real-time fashion. And as of the day on which I recorded this demo, this feature is available for most computer vision models. Let me show you how it works. I have an image on which I would like to perform an inference. And to try out this model with my image, I need to click on this button which says try product demo. Now let me upload the image of my choice. You can see that the image shows a human operating a forklift in a warehouse. When I upload this picture, it shows the inference. You can see that the ML model identified a human. It identified a table over here and it identified this forklift as a truck. If you scroll down, you'll be able to individually see the confidence of identification for each of the objects. And you can see the detailed response of the model right over here. You can see a general purpose ML model does a great job of identifying general objects, but we need custom ML models that can identify specialized machinery. So let me type forklift over here. When I type forklift, you can see that there is a model that specifically identifies forklifts in a picture. Let's see if the model does what it says. Let me click on try product demo and upload the image. You can see that the ML model was able to identify the forklift correctly with 99.69% confidence, and it also returned the bounding box of the forklift itself. But what about make, model, and year of the car? Well, let me do a search again for car make. This ML model seems promising. It clearly says that it is able to identify make, model, and year of the car. Let us try it out. Let me click on try product demo again. Now, let me upload this picture of a Hyundai Sonata 2009-2010 model. You can see that the ML model was able to identify make and model as stated in its description. 
with high confidence and it also identified the year as 2009-2010, which is correct. You can see that ML model did a good job of identifying the make, model, and year over here for this particular image. After a quick demo, if you want to evaluate this model further, I would recommend subscribing to the model and then using the console to run bash transform or real-time inference on your labeled validation data set and evaluating whether the model meets your expectation or not. To do so, click on continue to subscribe the button. In this case, I've already subscribed to the product. And then you can follow the wizard to deploy the ML model. You can also find additional instructions for deploying the ML model via console on this blog. And if you prefer deploying the ML model via a Jupyter notebook, feel free to use this generic notebook available in Amazon SageMaker examples repo to try out the ML model. If you need any further assistance, please leave feedback on the listing and we'll help you. You can also reach AWS Marketplace team on the email ID shown on the screen. Thank you.